The main function of the UBS is, of course, providing the Burmese people with accurate information, which is an enormous task to, to collect the, inf the information, which is dangerous, uh, and then sending it to Oslo and then sending it from Oslo into Burma again. So it's a big, huge operation, but I think it's of extreme importance uh, that the Burmese have the, have the access to, to, to accurate uh, information. Uh, mostly, you know, like the human rights abuses by the military regime in Burma, um, human rights abuses by the uh, local authorities. Uh, currently, we focus like the 2010 election in Burma. We provide Burma news to them because they are covering Burma, they could not get Burma okay. news in their own way. So okay. we provide to them. But since we have a lot of news about Burma, you know, we are Burma focused, okay. uh, so that you know, uh, we don't need news and information from them. But in very rare cases, in mean, very rare cases, if they make a documentary about Burma by using our materials, uh, we may broadcast that documentary. Uh, we really want DBB to become like the public uh, media organization in the future of Burma. Yeah, that 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 that, that, that is uh, no unavoidable. No. Um, but uh, fortunately, my uh, no one in the family, no one in my family, are working in the government service. Um, they they have less uh, interferes. But, um, for example, my mom or my, my sister, they, wherever they go, somebody keep following. Of course, uh, we can be you know, a target any time. And uh, what we worry most is our archive materials. So we have extra copies in safe place so that we don't lose anything. I think there may be only a little bit of relaxation in media freedom, but no, not a lot. In 1990, there was a wide range of media freedom. Political parties could declare their party line, party program to their government media. Even party leaders could give their speech to government radio and television. To be just and fair election, I think every political party should have uh, equal right on organizing people, media freedom, and reasonable financial assistance. But now, in Myanmar, such rights are only monopolized by USDA Association. They can freely organize people all over the country. They can release statements, declare their party line and program through government media. For a general election, there must be free, free, fair and transparent. Without the journalists, without the approach of the journalists, there won't be free election. As a journalist, you can't write anything, any words. Even now, you can't write those of the elections, those of the bodies, you can't write down the true things, what is happening in Burma, what is, even not for the election, even for the social things. So how can we say that we are free?